breaking travel news from across the world. Breaking travel news at the Arabian travel market in Dubai and I'm getting ready to take off with Turkish Airlines trying out their new business class seat and we have some breaking news because they will be flying to another destination in America. Adam, your new destination in America, tell us about this. Yes, inshallah we will launch after ATM, uh, Boston. Boston, yeah. Inshallah, it is the, our eighth, eighth destination in North America. Uh, okay. I want to give some information for this. All right. uh, we are flying North America eight destinations, but all the world we are uh, we are flying now 247 destinations, all the world. In how many countries? It's important. Yes, yeah. uh, 106 countries we are flying, and we are the first uh, as a uh, countries flown. We are the first in the world. Yeah, I mean you fly to more countries than any other airline, and. The service on here, the business class, you've got uh, the number one. It's important. And look uh, at this, we have yes, Turkish tea. Chef now and we got started in Middle East region. Yeah. Uh, we want to show all the visitors, ATM visitors are flying chef. Thank you very much. So uh, you got tea. Yeah, thank you. Thank you, our flying thank chef. Thank you. Thank you. Yes. Chef, thank you very much. That's the flying chef who's just joined us with Turkish tea. I got Turkish coffee and I've even got a delight, a Turkish delight here, which is my favorite sweet. Yeah. So you've got the Skytrax number one award for business class, I believe. Yes, uh, for three years we are the first uh, awarded by Skytrax, and uh, the last year we are awarded uh, for business class catering uh, okay. in business class. Uh, we are the first in the Europe. ATM is very important for uh, Turkish Airlines uh, because Middle East region is uh, the important region uh, in the in Turkish Airlines. We are flying uh, in Middle East, total t uh, 36 destinations. Uh, this seven of the Saudi Arabia, uh, six of uh, Iran, six of Iraq, and uh, four of uh, in Egypt, and other to to other destinations. Although in also in Gulf area, total 36 destinations. So very. We are growing. Yeah. Uh, the, the most growth growth, uh, growth uh, airline in the in this area. Okay. Uh, we recorded uh, 2013 uh, total 3.7 million passengers. We carry it. So you, you're seeing good growth in the GCC in the Middle East region. And yes. I must say, I've been trying the coffee. This Turkish yes. coffee yes. is very good yes, indeed. Turkish tea. And you got Turkish tea. So Adam, you have your Turkish tea. Sounds like the engines are revving up at the moment, getting ready for takeoff. And I was just looking behind the layout of these new business class seats. Yes. You've got a it's good length with a bed. Yes, it's all in our white body aircraft. We have like this full flat uh, business class seat. Yep. And it is, this seat is important uh, for Middle East region, also Gulf area, yeah. uh, for Dubai, Kuwait, Qatar and Bahrain, all this area, also Saudi Arabia, Riyadh, Jeddah, Medina. Right. Now, uh, this year also we changed our aircrafts in this area. What I want to ask is, yeah. Uh, white body. Okay, white yeah, body now. Yes. Yeah. Uh, we have the yes, C-Mix Airbus 330 and uh, Boeing 777. Okay. We have this aircraft. Well, the triple seven is very yes. good. Yes, I want to say this for the also Middle East uh, region. Uh, ins Inshallah, uh, uh, for the Turkish Airlines, right. we, we, we have aim uh, to reach the passengers. Uh, Inshallah, uh, 60 million passengers okay. in the end of this year. Sure. We have uh, last year we carried in Turkish Airlines uh, 48.3 mil uh, million passengers in the world so in Turkish yeah, Airlines. Okay. Right. Adam, I've just heard of the announcement. I think we're getting ready for takeoff, so I think we'll finish our uh, tea and coffee, put our seat belts on, mm -hmm. and get ready to take off for Boston, which is happening yes. in May. Turkish Airlines, breaking news, TV, and flying off to Boston from Istanbul.